Hello again everyone and welcome back to Time Traveler's Coin Exchange. The next coin we're going to take a look at is a 1919p Lincoln Wheat Cent. This one is a business strike coin from the Philadelphia Mint. And I have to say this one looks like it just came out of a like new bankroll. Um, but uh, this one's been graded by PCGS and uh, they graded it Mint State 65 Red Brown. So I don't know, uh, at least on the front here, it is looking pretty darn red. Um, I have not gone to look at the reverse yet, except for taking a quick photo. Um, so we will see what the reverse looks like here in just a second. But I think this might be one of the nicest coins from the teens uh, that I've ever had. Um, let's take a look at the reverse. But I wanna see this up close. I should have done this before. Um, it almost kind of looks like it has um, some sort of toning to it. Um, I wouldn't say it's attractive and I wouldn't say it detracts from it. It's just the, the copper has various shades of uh, red, um, you know, like a MS-65 red brown colors. <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, it looks, you know, like just different shades of copper. Um, I would say around the rim. Uh, is kind of a more orangey, uh, natural orange kind of copper color, uh, while in the center is more of a yellower, blonder uh, copper color. Um, I'm kind of surprised. I guess I will agree that it's not, if we're, if we're going to say a red coin is all one color, then this is not all one color. I would say the front, the front basically looks all red like maybe there's a little bit of adjustment in colors towards the edges but uh this is one of the nicest uh coins from the teens you know 1919 is probably 1919p is probably one of the more common coins from the teen of course uh but still of this grade um this is really beautiful. Um, this is really a treat to see. This is probably one of the nicest examples of a coin from that decade that I have gotten to see. I mean, look at those wheat lines. I mean, it's like, there's like kind of like blemish maybe above the one, above the O and above the E. And the luster is not perfect. But it's pretty darn nice. I mean, it's like, like this front is gorgeous. I don't know. I really appreciate this coin. Um, it might, maybe I should be, you know, spending just a little bit more, you know, maybe buying a little bit less modern and uh, just putting a little bit higher bids on some of the older coins, uh, getting just things just a little bit nicer. Um, I think it would be possibly a treat for you guys all. And uh, speaking of treats, if you guys didn't see uh, on the community page and the video I made, uh, I did a GAW video uh, on one of the videos I've done. Uh, there will be a pop-up, uh, and if you click on that pop-up, uh, you'll see a word. And if you're the first person to bring that word and leave a comment uh, on the giveaway video, um, and you have a U.S. PayPal account, I will send you $10 um, first person only. But uh, try to make things a little bit more fun here. I'm trying to say thank you guys for all the support. You guys gave me the energy to make, I think, 3,800 videos now. Um, so I just wanted to say thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you guys enjoy the scavenger hunts, I will do more. Um, so have a beautiful day, everyone, and enjoy watching. Uh, and now you might end up just a little bit richer besides the knowledge uh, you might gain while watching the videos just by watching the videos. Alright, thanks everyone. See you guys in the future.